We weren't expecting much. Most likely, there's nothing that Rockstar could do on a weekly drip feed to actually make it better than last week's Moonshiner bonus because that was some easy cash. We made some good money there, no problem. So this week, we got a few small gifts and a fairly good bonus for doing some strange emissions. Let's jump right into it right now and just, you know, quick and easy. Howdy, Cowpoke. Austin BMX here. Thanks for checking out today's video. If you're going to like this video, make sure to smash that like button. If you're new around here, consider subscribing to the channel for more Red Line content, including tips and tricks, news updates, gameplay, just good old-fashioned fun. Yes, before anyone notices, I probably look like crap and sound like crap. It's because it's like 6 a.m. right now. Yeah, living on the West Coast sucks for drip feed day. But we're here getting a video out for you guys, letting you guys know all the little small bonuses we get and the good way to make some money this week. Let's jump right into it. We got it right here. Let's pull them up here so we can take a look. We have bonuses for hunting legendary animals this week in Red Dead Online. Yes. Harriet will be mad at you. She's mad at us all the time. She's mad at me like all the time, apparently, but we get a bonus for hunting animals this week, plus bonuses for free roam missions and more. Lots of small little stuff. Let's jump into it. Anyone First thing, all you got to do is go find a legendary animal, hunt it down, kill it, skin it, and you'll get 100 rounds of Nitro Express ammo for the Element Rifle. If you own the Elephant Rifle, that's pretty awesome. You also get a weight gain tonic and a weight loss tonic. These aren't worth much, but they are pretty fun to use. If you guys haven't used them yet, if you didn't pay for them because they are freaking expensive, definitely get these for free and uh, go ahead and use it and see what happens. It's pretty funny. Bring that carcass after you do that, though, to Gus. You'll receive two fast travel vouchers. You know, last week we had free fast travel. Now we get two free ones this week, you know, and a snowy egret plume. It's worth like $2.50 just for showing up to Gus. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Why are there if you craft a trinket or a coat with Gus this week, which costs hundreds of dollars, you'll receive an offer for 40% off an established or a distinguished naturalist item of your choice. If you don't already own everything, uh, you'll spend a hundred bucks or hundreds of bucks, hundreds of bucks. Yeah. And get 40% off something. Fantastic. Animal lovers, hunters, and naturals of all sorts who play Reddit online this week will receive thousand naturals XP and five animal revivers. Great bonus there for sure. Also, if you're not a naturalist uh, this week, it is five gold bars off. So if you want to get into the naturalist game, you know, you want to go hang out with Harriet for a little bit, you can get five gold bars off. Not too bad. Our big bonus this week, like I said, nothing is going to compete at all with the nat with the bonus we had last week with the Moonshiner. That was some easy money, man. Just letting Marcel make some stuff and selling Moonshine for like 370 bucks a run. I mean, come on. That was super easy. We have double... RDO cash on free roam missions. I mean, this is actually pretty good as well. Uh, I've been thinking about it. And I mean, it takes a little bit more work than making a delivery, but actually can make some pretty good dang money with this. Some missions pay out more than others. I think on the hunt are pretty good ones from like uh, Sadie and Hamish. Uh, I think there's someone else that gives you on the hunt sometimes as well. On the hunt's usually pretty good. Make sure you guys are using the 12-minute mark for these to get the most cash for your time. If you're just looking to grind that cash, you'll get double the money for it. So all Stranger Missions, all the orange icons all over the map are paying out double RDO cash this week. Not too bad. Go check it out. Sales and bonuses and discounts. Let's see what we got. Nothing really amazing, but if you're looking for a few of these things, it might help you out. We have 40% off American paint and Andalusian horses. Not too bad. Half off all the blankets, horns, and bedrolls, which, you know, gives you a little bit of customization to your horse. We were talking about that in yesterday's video. Although if we if you use an improved saddle, I don't think you can change any of that stuff at all, which we do. I use the Upland saddle right now from the Bounty Hunter expansion, so I can't even change any of that stuff at all. But 40% off two horse breeds. We have the American paint and the uh, 
and illusion, right? I think I'm pronouncing that correct. Yeah, and illusion. We also have half off, which is 50%, blankets, horns, and bedrolls. We have 30% off all rifles, so if you need to pick one up, I might pick up the rolling block. I, no, I think I own it, but everyone's been running around shooting everybody with it, and it's a pretty nice freaking gun. But I usually use a Carcano, you know, all those fun stuff, and uh, bolt action, great guns there. 30% off, you guys need to pick up a gun at all. Rifles are uh, always definitely good. We got a few limited time clothing item returns. We got the fan stovetop hat. We got the Herba Heart coat. We got the... Mac Bay jacket. And uh, for the ladies, we got the, I think this is for the ladies. I don't think I've ever seen a guy wear a corset, but, you know, who who knows? There might be somebody in Red Dead. We have the campless corset and the Danube outfit. Pretty nice. A couple extra discounts we have. We already talked about the horns here. 50% off the blankets, horns, and bedrolls. We do have 30% off all coats. We have 30% off the improved bow variants, all trinkets, and gauntlets, which is pretty good. So if trinkets are 30% off... And then if you buy one, you get like a 40% off coupon for something else. I mean, you could double dip there a little bit. We have 30% off Harriet's Tonics. Again, uh, yeah, not really worth it there. We have 40% off the Wilderness Campfire if you have not picked up the Wilderness Campfire at all yet. And we have 30% off Fast Travel Post. That must be for your camp. It doesn't say that, but it's got to be. 30% off Fast Travel Camp for your post is absolutely fantastic. I think it's like rank 60-something, though, you got to be to pick that up. That's it. That's it. That's it. It is May. And uh, I was figuring we're probably going to go through a kind of a slow month in May. Usually the outlaw passes kind of end on a downward a downward note. We have like how many drip feed weeks we have left before this tough or we have only three more. We have three more drip feed weeks until June 1st. Will we get something new on June 1st? That's the big thing. Will we get something new on June 1st? We talked about it a lot in our video yesterday. If you guys haven't already, I'll link it up here. Go check it out. Talking about uh, possibility of LL Pass number six, what could be in that, and what we all want in that. So make sure to go let me know in the comments on that video as well. And uh, we'll just be grinding some Stranger Missions this week, which isn't too bad because it does give you a lot of stuff to go do. These bonuses, usually we say, you know, use them as the ability to go out and, uh, you know, give you objectives for the day. And there's quite a lot of different stranger missions out there. You can go all the way up to Sadie's place, way up in the snow. Uh, you can go down and do Sean's missions. The boy, the boy mission in Valentine, try to try to find the boy mission in Valentine and get him to give you the boat theft mission. Cause let me tell you, I gotta go back and find that mission again, because it is absolutely so much fun to do. Um, uh, I just, I think me and the posse failed it last time we did it, but it is a lot of fun. It's a freaking boat theft mission down the rapids of Dakota River. I mean, come on. That's pretty awesome. That's all we got, guys. A few discounts, a few bonuses, and double money on Stranger Missions. What are you guys going to be grinding this week? Let me know down in the comments. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button. If you're new around here, consider subscribing to the channel for more Red Dead Online content, including tips and tricks, news updates, gameplay. Just good old-fashioned fun. Hope to see you on the prairie sometime, but until then, see you later.